hello friends welcome to video number 8 now we are trying to learn the topic economic value added and now this is example number 2 so this is example number 2 welcome to all of you just check out the example xyz limited has existing assets in which it has capital it has capital invested of rupees 150 crore the after tax operating income is rupees 20 crore company has overall cost of capital of rupees of 12% so check out this is a xyz limited company and it has the existing asset of rupees 150 crore it means company's investment is of rupees 150 crore the after tax operating income is of rupees 20 crore so net operating income after tax is directly given to you as a 20 crore, as rupees 20 crore and company has overall cost of capital of 12% so overall cost of capital of the company that means wacc weighted average cost of capital is 12% which is also directly given to us and what is asked compute economic value added of the company already we have learned in the earlier video how to compute economic value added for calculating economic value added we require mainly three components the first component is net operating profit after tax abbreviation we call it as nopat that means net operating profit after tax so that net operating profit after tax is given in the example you can check out the second line of example the after tax operating income is of rupees 20 crore so which is given to us 20 Growth. Next component is capital invested. Now capital invested. Check out the first line of the example. X Y Z Limited has existing assets in which it has capital invested of rupees hundred and fifty crore. So this is the invested capital of the company. That is rupees hundred and fifty crore. and third one is weighted average cost of capital that is a wacc which is also directly given to us company has overall cost of capital of 12% so this is nothing but the weighted average cost of capital or uh, symbolically we call it as a ko so that is 12% so it means here we have got all the three components of the example for calculating eva we require three component net operating profit after tax amount of capital invested and the rate of weighted average cost of capital and all this three information is available now easily we can calculate eva check it out eva formula is given net operating profit after tax minus capital invested into weighted average cost of capital so net operating profit after tax already we have seen it is 20 crore so it is 20 net operating profit after tax 20 crore minus into bracket amount of capital invested how much is the amount of capital invested which is given the Check out the second component, hundred and fifty crore. So hundred and fifty into weighted average cost of capital. So weighted average cost of capital rate is twelve percent. So that is twelve percent bracket complete. So here, if we solve it, is equal to twenty minus into bracket hundred and fifty into twelve. Percent 
आंसर इज टू दैट इज टू करोड EVA is equal to two crore. You can check out EVA is two crore. It is very simple. Total amount of capital invested is rupees hundred and fifty crore, on which twelve percent is the rate of cost of capital. So twelve percent of hundred and fifty that comes to eighteen eighteen crore, twenty crore net operating profit after tax twenty crore minus eighteen crore. Economic value addition is equal to two crore. It means that this company. For X Y Z Limited, this year there is an economic value addition of rupees two crore. Means after payment of the entire cost of capital, that is the cost of debt, cost of reference capital, and cost of equity capital, still there will be the return earnings of rupees two crore. Means company's net worth will increase by rupees two crore this year. This is economic value addition. I hope. you have understood you must have understood this example thank you very much